Hello, good evening. Everything set up beautifully. It's a perfect night for football at the King Power Stadium. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined, as always, by Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Leicester City up against Tottenham Hotspur. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Number four, a striker you can simply never write off. Jamie Vardy, of course, he has so much know-how. Stuart, what are you anticipating seeing from him? Well, Derek, he's the perfect finisher. He's got a great shot on him, his movement is excellent, and in 1v1 situations, you always expect him to score. Here's how Leicester City will line up. Kasper Schmeichel stands between the posts. Ricardo Pereira plays with Ryan Bertrand in the fullback positions. Yuri Tiedemans plays alongside Wilfred Ndidi in the engine room. And operating through the middle in attack, Jamie Vardy. Introducing the Spurs starting 11. Hugo Lloris is the goalkeeper. Matt Doherty plays with Reggie Long in the fullback positions. Lucas Moura plays with Hyun Min Son out wide. And the main striker today is Harry Kane. It's a very attractive match in prospect, and it's Tottenham Hotspur who get things underway. And fed forwards. Spurs get the advantage from the referee. And a body in the way. Son. Corner conceded, it came off the defender. They take it short. Not sufficiently accurate, that pass from Lucas. Tielemans. They've regained possession. Harry Kane. Went in strongly, decisively. Oliver Skip. Lucas with it. Cross towards Harry Kane, at the back post. But it wasn't quite as good as it looked when it was played over. James Madison. Now with Perez. Tielemans. Oh, they have it again. Lucas. Now Harry Kane. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Leicester couldn't hang on to it. Matt Doherty. Well, a good tackle. Given away again. A foul it most certainly was. Free kick given. The referee might well have been tempted to book him for that. Resisted the temptation.
Tielemans. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Counter attacking, very much an option. Given away by Tottenham. Kane. Fabier. A fine reading of the situation. Can he put them in front? But it was a wonderful chance, but the goalkeeper comes through. Yes, Derek, we have to give credit to the keeper, but surely he should have scored there. That's a big, big chance. Corner kick played in. Just over the top in the end. Lucas. Oliver skip. And Kane comes into the move. Good looking attack, this. Deli Alley. Son has done it. Well, as a finisher, you have to be almost cold blooded, and it certainly applied to him on that occasion. Well, here we can see it again, and the passing and movement is a joy to watch. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. Underway again, and Tottenham with the advantage. Ndidi. And now Ryan Bertrand. James Madison. Vardy. Madison. Body in the way. Son. Now Harry Kane. Well, they know they need to stop him. And so it is. The first half story has been written. Well, certainly, Hyung Min Son was very hard to contain in the first 45. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, it was certainly a good first 45 minutes for the lad. Obviously, he got his goal to put them in front, but he's looked lively throughout, too. Hopefully, we see more of him in the second half. So the second half underway with Leicester behind. Can they turn this game around? Harvey Barnes. Well, that's how to beat your opponent. Can they square the game? Terrific piece of anticipation. Well, no danger now. Delhi. Now Harry Kane. They've chosen to go through Harry Kane. Options around him. Takes on the shots. Well, the keeper made the save pretty easily in the end. That is how to apply the pressure. Vardy. James Madison. On to Perez. Well, they keep passing away. James Madison. 
Vardy. And now Ndidi. A bit sloppy in possession. And into the last 30 minutes now. James Madison. Vardy. Worth the try. Now the keeper grabs it. Tielemans. And the ball is loose. Well, they can bring it out now. Crisp tackling. Oh, fancy footwork. Perez has someone to play it to. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Magnificent defending. A reminder that foul and abusive language will not be tolerated in the stadium. Under a fair bit of pressure. And a goal kick will be next. Substitution for Tottenham Hotspur. Could and a substitution in the offing. On the Coming onto the pitch, number 18, Giovanni Lasalso. Ricardo Pereira. Daka. Lost possession. Lo Celso. Doherty has it. As clean as a whistle, that challenge. And attempting the through ball. He's in behind the defence here. Oh, tremendous work from the keeper to avert the danger. A corner then. And with time running out, they've got to ask questions. Time for a change then. Number seven, Harvey Barnes. To be replaced by number 11, Mark Albrighton. Substitution for Tottenham Hotspur. Coming off the pitch, number 27. And he's fired over the corner. And the danger clear. Body in the way. Madison crossing into the middle. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw in. Ndidi read it well. It might be perfectly set up for the counter attack, you know. They need to get bodies back. And it's gone out of play. Goal kick coming up. So a personnel change then. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. James Madison. So the final whistle and frustration for Leicester City fans around the world. They've lost this game. What did you make of it? Well, Derek, not quite good enough today. Yes, they only lost by one goal, but I never felt they were in control of the game. A frustrating day all round for the coach to think about for the next time. So, a top-level contribution from Hyung Min Son. How many times do we say that? Quite a lot is the answer. Stuart, sum up for us what impressed you. Well, he gave them a really hard time, didn't he? His speed of thought was excellent, and he took the winning goal so well. He was brilliant today.